Hello, I'm Dr. John McDougall. I'm the founder and the director of the McDougall program. In this program, we get to take care of people with all kinds of problems. And I'd have to say, one of the most common problems that people have, and one of the greatest worries they have, is their blood cholesterol is too high. Yeah, well, there's a reason everybody knows about this, and that is that the cholesterol pill-lowering businesses, you know, those businesses that sell pills that lower your cholesterol, they've taken great effort to educate you on how important cholesterol is. And it is important. I mean, people who have an elevated cholesterol, it reflects a higher chance of having problems like strokes and heart attacks and even cancer because that elevated cholesterol means you're eating too much cholesterol. That's right. And cholesterol is only found in animal products. And when you eat animal products like chicken and fish and beef and pork and cheese, what happens is your blood cholesterol goes up. It's a sign that you're just eating too much of these rich foods. The answer, of course, is to get these cholesterol-laden foods out of your diet. Plant foods contain not a speck of cholesterol. So you switch to a plant food-based diet, and what happens is your blood cholesterols, they start to drop immediately. In fact, we get an average drop of cholesterol of about 30 points in seven days. That's right. That's better than cholesterol-lowering medications can do. And at the same time, we reduce or eliminate cholesterol-lowering medications. And I do this for a couple of reasons, not only because cholesterol comes down, when people make sensible dietary changes, in other words, just get the cholesterol-laden foods out of the diet, but also because most people who are on these cholesterol-lowering medications, and I mean statins, statin medications, most of these people who are on these cholesterol-lowering medications shouldn't even be on them in the first place because the scientific research says clearly they do not work in otherwise healthy people. Yeah, you know, you take somebody who's really sick, who's had a heart attack or a stroke or angioplasty or bypass surgery, you can give them cholesterol-lowering medications, statins, and you can show a tiny reduction in the risk of death and heart attacks. The medications are not that effective, and that's why you have to take really sick people to see results. But you take otherwise healthy people like yourselves, most of you, who just have elevated cholesterol, who are at relatively low risk of having one of these tragedies like a heart attack or a stroke then in people like yourselves, when you take cholesterol-lowering medications, you can't see the benefits. And that's what a review of 11 randomized controlled trials has shown. That's right, that's basically all the trials. It's people who are relatively healthy. Now I realize older, high cholesterol, high blood pressure, relatively healthy. You give them the statins, they don't make a difference. So you're left with just one solution, and that is you've got to deal with a problem. And the problem's the diet. And you can fix that. That's right, you can switch to a no-cholesterol, low-fat diet. You'll be amazed with the results. Not only will your cholesterol drop, but all the other things you're looking for, you'll get them, and quickly, and you deserve them. I'm Dr. John McDougall. Thank you for listening.